Nicola Sturgeon has been accused of making bogus promises over a pledge to rebuild Scotland from coronavirus over independence, as the First Minister marks 100 days in office since the 2021 Holyrood election. The Scottish Conservatives have accused the SNP leader of breaking a large number of promises she made to voters in May by focusing on separation from the UK. The long list of 13 pledges includes a failure to publish an NHS recovery plan which the SNP promised would include a 10% increase in inpatient, day case and outpatient activity. Scottish Tory leader Douglas Ross claimed that Ms Sturgeon's promises are now it is in tatters for everyone to see. The Murray MP said today, once again, all they can do is try to spin their way out of it. You'll hear Nicola Sturgeon claim that independence is essential to Scotland's recovery and that without it, we won't be able to get back on our feet. It's a desperate throw of the dice from a faltering nationalist campaign. Their obsession with another referendum is exactly why they're failing to tackle the deep problems they've created over the past 14 years. Distraction gets in the way of delivery. Elsewhere, the party has also pledged to take early steps to launch an inquiry into the coronavirus pandemic, but this is yet to happen. It is also claimed the SNP-led Scottish Government are not on target to vaccinate all adults after they pledged to complete the vaccination of all adults, subject to supply, within their first 100 days. The most recent government figures show that only 73.8% of the population have had two doses of the vaccine. Scottish Conservative analysis reveals that if the current daily rate of around 17,000 doses continues, ministers will miss the 12th of September target by over 500,000. The SNP also pledged to begin the planning for provision of tablets and laptops to all school children, but have not confirmed any further progress towards this manifesto pledge. Annie Wells MSP, Scottish Conservative Health spokesperson said the First Minister's 100-day pledge looks like another set of broken promises in the making.